Hello everybody, Luke Skywalker899 here, and here I am back with Lava Line the Mage in my next part. Now we're going to talk with Warden Blackwall before we go on to Champions of the Just. And... And, uh... While I was not recording, I got enough power, as you guys can see, with 18 power now. And, uh... I cleared a rift in a castle, I cleared a bunch of rifts, I got a bunch of, uh, cultists living in the woods to, uh, work for a spies Liliana, I got Ritz as an agent, I cleared the rift in front of, uh, Redcliffe, and so now I am going to talk to Blackwall, and then we shall start our mission. Let us do this. So much easier to ignore when it's far away. Not really. And to actually walk out of it, to be that close. I was up there fighting. It's right there. We could take a trip if you're that curious. I'm going to have to decline. At least until I learn more about it. The breach, the divine's death, the wardens. It doesn't make sense. There's so much we don't know. Your experience with the Wardens will certainly be useful. Probably. Mostly the treaties, I expect. Old parchments you're welcome to. What about you? How do you fit into all this? I just want to help stop the war. Try to put things back in order. A worthy goal, one I'm happy to support. For me, I'll be satisfied so long as we find the bastards that killed the Divine. They owe us some answers. Alrighty then, let's go do the mission champions of the just. Blah, 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 fast travel. Alrighty guys, so this episode, as I said, we're going to be doing champions of the just, which many of you probably wouldn't be expecting considering how I'm playing as the mage. But now, mm -mm, no. so let's do this. Uh, no, no one talks to you. Okay, let's do this. champions of the just right now. And <clears throat> Liliana and Josephine have been working tirelessly to con convince Carus and what are some of Orlais' most influential houses. Ten noble families will help the Inquisition, pressure the Templars into sealing the breach, traveling to Theronfall ribbed out, and demanding the Lord Seeger deal with them or face the wrath of Orlais. The Inquisition has promised the Herald of Andraste as its voice in these negotiations. Let's do this. The Templars must help us close the breach. The Order was founded to fight magic. We must first convince the Lord Seeker to bring the Templars out of exile. We've received word from a knight recruit. They gather at Therenfall Redoubt. It has been vacant for decades. Why go there? I don't know. We must approach the Lord Seeker again to get anywhere. We can ask him then. The Lord Seeker made it clear he isn't interested in anyone unimportant. So we must change how he sees us. No? Good if point. If status the Lord Seeker seeks, the Inquisition will approach him after allying with the noblest houses in Orle. They'll come with us to Therenfall and demand the Templars help close the breach. You believe that will work? Even the Lord Seeker would find it difficult to ignore so many nobles on his doorstep. Yes. Especially when led by the Herald of Andraste. If it stops the sky from ripping open, I'm listening. Rumors you were saved from the Fade by Andraste have grown legion among the Templars. Ah. We've done our part to encourage them. A Herald with a few companions may be dismissed, easily set aside. That same Herald returning with noble support will be reconsidered. Funniest thing is, As well just recently, today, I was going around stabbing Templars, now I'm going to try and recruit them. Hello, lovely. 
And by earlier in the game, I mean Assassin's Creed, for those of you not aware. Isn't there the slightest chance the Lord Seeker will see my arrival as a threat? Before, I would have thought he was a man of reason. Now, I could not say. With respect, after his appearance in Valroyo, hang what the Lord Seeker thinks. Yes. We do not need the Lord Seeker. We need his Templars, with or without his approval. The breach will not wait for our differences to Beat him up and then take it from him. Or them from him. Good news. Several noble or legion houses will petition the Templars to help us stop the breach. Lord Dabernash will approach you. Sign nothing he offers, but his gossip is reliable. I hope he knows the Lord Seeker's mood. The Templars will never help without his consent. Alrighty then, let us do this. To Theron Fall, how much time do I have? Seven minutes already? Okay, so, for this mission I think I'll have Varric. Hmm. I think I'll have Sarah, Varric, and Cassandra. Mm. Yeah, that sounds fair. Let's do this. For those of you who have not played Dragon Age, I do recommend it. It is one of the best games of all time. I'm not gonna lie, it is one of my favorite games. Oh, cutscene, yay. Stupid loading screen. Takes too long. Yay. The Herald of Andraste. Lord Esmeral Abernash. Honored to participate. It is not unlike the second dispersal of the reclaimed Dales. Nothing. I'd heard a Trevelyan or two took up the cause there. The Lord Seeker is willing to hear our petition about closing the breach. A credit to our alliance with the Inquisition. Care to mark the moment? Ten Aldesian houses walk with you. Mm. Noble knowledge. It's a shining day to have the best of all lay in step with the Inquisition. The first of many inspirational and influential partnerships, I hope. Oh, you're a natural. People will give you anything. Hooray. Speaking of which, I don't suppose you'd divulge what finally got their attention. Rumor will, if you won't. What do you mean? The Lord Seeker won't meet us until he greets the Inquisition in person. Quite a surprise the after the spat in Val Royale. The Inquisition only asks the Lord Seeker help us close the breach. Then it's all been arranged by your ambassador. Let the diplomats uh, work their magic if you trust them. Between you and I, the Chantry never took advantage of their Templars. Wiser heads should steer them. Here we are. They're in fall, redoubt. Oh, it screams. I hate fun and kick puppies, doesn't it? It appears they've sent someone to greet you. Oh, Varric, you're Present hysterical. Well. Everyone is a little tense for my liking. These lords are useful, but none of this should be necessary. Surely the Lord Seeker sees the true threat. What is he playing at? The Lord Seeker changed his mind about us rather quickly. Is he known for that? Attack of conscience? I hear they happen once or twice an age. Was that a person up there? That's a person and a glowing bird. Huh. Alright, that might be an Easter egg. I don't know. I present Knight Templar, Sir Delrin Baris. Second son of Van Jeffren Baris of Ferelden. 
Step out. May I be so honored as to present Lord Esmeral Abanache? I'm the one who sent word to Cullen. He said the Inquisition works to close this breach in the veil. I didn't think you'd bring such lofty company. Paris. Moderate holdings, your family. And the second son? <laughs> this promise of status has garnered interest from the Lord Seeker. Beyond sense. The sky burns with magic, but he ignores all calls to action until your friends arrive. Should a Seeker lead the Templars this way? I'm sure that In should. an emergency, if there's no other recourse. But his goal should be to restore them to order. He has taken command. Permanently. If he fears there is a holy mandate. That is what the Lord Seeker claims, and our commanders parrot him. Wait. Your commanders sit on his shoulders and repeat and ask for crackers? No he promised Weird. to restore the Order's honor, then marched us here to wait. Templars should know their duty, even when held from it. About time one of you gobs said that. Win over the Lord Seeker. And every able-bodied knight will help the Inquisition seal the breach. I have a feeling the Lord Seeker will take some convincing. I wish I could reassure you. Lately, he sees no one but the officer. Or I could just be the heck out of him. Much after that shameful display in Valroyo. Our truth changes on the hour. Don't keep your betters waiting, Barris. There's important work for those born to it. Well, you're a jerk. Hmm. The Lord Seeker has a request before you meet him. These are the standards. An honored right centered on the people, the Maker, and the Order. The Lord Seeker asks that you perform the right so he may see the Order in which you honor them. What if I fail? Well, there's no correct answer. The ritual simply shows Watchers who you are and what you value. We'd be honored, if that's what the Lord Seeker asks of the Inquisition. Not the Inquisition. <clears throat> the Lord Seeker changed everything to meet you. Not the Inquisition. You. By name. That's weird. Why? I don't know. He's been fixated on you ever since your horde of nobles arrived. The Lord Seeker makes us shuffle flags around. Refuse! Let's meet the man or We'll complete the ritual as the Lord Seeker requests. When you've completed the rite, I'll take you to him. Once you finish the standard, the Lord Seeker will see you. Hang your own draperies, knight. We business. These aren't draperies, this is a test, you fool. What does the Lord Seeker want to see you get about? The Herald's choice, Abanash. Please welcome to the Templars. Not some upstart order. Here we are. Traditionally, a participant in the rite now explains their choices to those assembled. Those are my choices. The rest is my own affair. It's rather not. I'll not be shut out of any explanation these clods understand, if we're bringing them to heal. I eyes. suppose those are your intentions. My intent is to deal with people who matter. You hell louts are wasting the Inquisition's time and my time. Not wasting my time. Unacceptable. The Lord Seeker awaits you both. Follow me. Well, everyone, that's going to be it for this video. I will see you in the next part. I'm not going to sign off, but I will see you people in the next part.